Hey guys, how are you? Today we're gonna to talk about the brand new Jones Road Bomb that just came out. It's called Flushed and it's beautiful. That's the wrong, that's the wrong one. <laughs> this one is a pink flushed color. Guys, look at this. How fun is that? So if you wanna know all about Flushed, keep on watching y'all. <laughs> I don't have it on yet. Nope, not yet, but we will. Thank you guys for being here. My name is Jennifer. You can call me Jen. My friends call me Jen. I have a brand new setup right here, guys, and I am, I'm feeling it. I'm feeling it. <laughs> yeah, I'm just really excited because it's kind of, it just works right now, and I'm kind of loving it. I'm kind of loving it. So I am just, I have received a good bit of questions about the Jones Rhodes bombs. And I kind of want to just show you how I personally use them. You don't need a lot. Okay. And I've always said in my videos, you're either going to love, like love these bombs or you're not going to like them at all. So I'm using Al Natural. This is Al Natural. It looks like this. And Really, I use I can use them a couple different ways. I'll use them and really apply kind of as a base under foundation. I love this under foundation. And a lot of people, I don't think a lot of people know like you can use it like this. So I will wear under foundation. I'll actually put it under my eyes to hydrate the under eye. Now, if you have oily oily skin, I probably wouldn't recommend doing this because you're going to just, you'll have, you know, a bombier, <laughs> oilier texture and it may not be the look you're going for, but guys, oh my goodness, how it just feels so good. Like so good on the skin. And honestly, guys, it really evens out a little bit of the texture, but it also helps to kind of minimize the appearance of my pores. I feel that way. And I think you'll see it as I put on my sticks. I have the sticks, the Jones Road sticks, and I'm really honestly putting them, I'm, I'm kind of going through it for you guys so that it's easy to, just a whole look really. So I can explain kind of how I use it. And I had received some questions about certain things, um, longevity of the product. Guys, I mean, I've had a couple of these products for over a year and they have, I have a mirror right here. I'm just looking at the mirror here. Um, I've had these products for over a year. They do have a two year shelf life, but guys, these, last a long time. You do not need a lot at all. And it's just so easy. Now I've have received questions. Is it sticky? If you use a lot of this product, yes. I mean, it's going to be tacky. <laughs> I'm just going all in. It is going to be a tackier, balmy product. But if you use less, then it won't be. With the new balm, you really don't need a lot to get the pigment. So therefore, it's not gonna feel tacky at all. So, some people asked about powder products. So do you use powder on top of the balm or can you use powder on top of the balm? Do you use powder underneath the balm? Yeah. I do both. They both work great. Um, I have no issues at all using anything like that. Now, you see me apply directly to, you know, the skin. So like this. That's the easiest way, guys, to apply these sticks. Now I have, I don't know what is going on right here. <laughs> you know, breakout central, you know, that time. It's very normal. <laughs> so this, you can also take the stick and kind of put it on your finger. And if you want to apply it that way, you can. So it just, it varies. It's like whatever you want. 
This is so fun. Okay, are we good? Now, even doubt, could I probably use a good old, I have shade 10. Now this is more of a peachy tone for me. So it's going to see how it kind of eliminates a lot of that redness. That was shade six before. See how that like cuts the redness or the darkness? All the deep dark spots. <laughs> oh well, you know, it's not, it is what it is. I'm not 20 anymore. <laughs> Our birthday's this month, guys. <laughs> Speaking of being 20. <laughs> not 20 anymore. So I hope the volume and the, so I got a new microphone. I'm really excited. I got a new stand. So pumped. All right, so let's get into the bombs. Let's talk about the bombs. I will swatch them all for you so that you can see them all comparatively speaking. Side by side, I do have them all. I know. <laughs> I'm like, because I love them. I really do love them. I love the company. I just, I don't know. I, I really do. So most of these I bought myself. A few were sent to me, but I always like to disclose if that were the case. All right. So we have one, two, three, four, five, six. I'm back. <laughs> I got nervous there because I couldn't find one of them. The one I was looking for was Sunkissed right here. But I have all, let's see, eight. <laughs> I'm a miracle bomb hoarder. <laughs> oh my gosh, okay. Gotta keep it going though. The collection just keeps, keeps on giving. Okay, let's start with number, let's start with the lightest. This is light and definitely has just a palest, palest, almost like no color at all, but just like a, very light color. So that is Au Natural. Very light, very light. A very small amount of pink to it, but not really. I would say the next one up would be Dusty Rose. It's a gorgeous shade. So you can see these together. Here we go. This one has a bit of does it have shimmer i feel like it does but no not really hold on no i'm no i'm curious maybe just the teeniest tiniest teeniest tiniest bit so there you are with dusty rose so on after all dusty rose we're going into the pink one next <laughs> This is flushed. Now this is pink, guys. And you can see here, it's not shimmery per se. It's very pink, <laughs> which I personally love. It has a bit of a tinge of shimmer, but not like, you're not, to the naked eye, it doesn't, you can't see it, if that makes sense. Like if you look at it, it doesn't look shimmery. All right, now we're getting into the more brownie stage, brownie red tone. Bronze, I think would be like your next shade. This is beautiful as, now this has a little bit of shimmer in it. Beautiful as a bronzer, or you can wear it as, you definitely wear this as on your lips. You can wear it as, a blush. It has some shimmer. It's a beautiful bronzy shade. Definitely warm. So if you're not looking for warm, that's not for you. <laughs> now, this one is called Sunkissed. Now, Sunkissed is deep, but it has more brown in it than not. So it does have a little bit of very, very, if you look close, a little bit of gold shimmer reflect. And I'm just looking at myself. So you can see here how much deeper this one is. Now, I'm just kinda, I'm gonna try to blend some out here. So you can kinda see how they blend out some. 
you can see. And then we have this here is Tawny. And Tawny is one of my most favorite shades, most worn shades. Now Tawny is like a brownie, kind of reddy, just a Tawny. It's literally Tawny. <laughs> that pink you can tell is so pink compared to all the other shades that she's come out with so far. Tawny does have a bit of shimmer, not a ton. Like again, very faint, very faint shimmer there. Now, if you want to get into a shimmer bomb by Jones Rove, she has two. Let's see. Magic Hour just came back in stock. Magic Hour, see the shimmer? Has these gold shimmer reflex. It is gorgeous as like on the lips. Oh, it's so pretty. So I want to show you and as a highlighter, guys. You can definitely see with Magic Hour that definite reflect there. Now you can put it under, like if I wanted to go ahead, I'm just gonna show you. I didn't even, I just took what was on my finger and you can see the reflect there. And I'm gonna take over my finger here, just so you can see the reflect. But I'm gonna show you how I put bronzer on top of it in a minute. Let me show you one more. Disco, guys, was limited edition. She said, I think I heard her say they're trying to get it back because this came out during the holidays and I love Disco. It's so pretty. Um, it's kind of more of a peachier, a lot of different, uh, like look at this. See, look at that, it's some gold in it. It is gorgeous. So here are all the bombs swatched. This is Disco, Magic Hour, this one's Tawny, this one's Sunkissed, Bronze, Flushed. What are you? Oh, I was doing so well. <laughs> Dusty Rose and Au Natural. So I hope that this is helpful for those who are looking at the bombs looking to see what color would be best for you. I personally, you know, like to use them for all these different things. Let's put this bad boy on. You can do it a couple different ways. I like to use my fingers. You can also use a brush. I do have her brush. Moving is like, can't find anything. Okay, so let's use the blush. I'm gonna use this as blush for the brush, the everything brush. So I will tap it just so I don't want to get like too much product. And then that's it. I tap in and just really tap. Can you see the color? Now, like I, I'll just take the rest that's on my hand and place here. This is, I think, one of my, I mean, this is such a great shade. It reminds me of some of the shades she's had at her previous company, as well as that natural, like, just, I just ran a marathon, but it was so easy. <laughs> Look. Or you've been out in the cold winter air, and you know, those like beautiful, that beautiful flush that you can get from that. Don't be afraid to use it other places. Don't be afraid. She's used it on the eyes, things like that. I personally don't like using these on the, on my eyes because I have so really oily eyelids. So for me, that's not really like my thing, but you can. Now, I'm gonna show you how I use this Gucci bronzer. It's what I have here. So I'm just gonna take a regular kind of bronzer brush and kind of show you how this can be toned down. Like if you're not into all the shine, I love a very pretty shine. You can take this and go over it. You don't need to use a ton of product, but you can see how you can use this on top. And it's okay. Now, 
you want to use a powder, an actual powder. Let me grab one. So I am just using a Cojun Dough powder. This is their Sheer Moist Powder. Manifashi it's Sheer Moist Powder. I think this one, yeah, I believe this one was gifted. I always, like I say, I always like to tell you. Um, I'm just going to use a powder brush. Make sure I get the powder in the bristles. And then what I'm gonna do, so I just wanna show you how you can powder this down. You still have the flush, you still have the real pretty, still have a little bit of a glow underneath. You can always add a little bit more on top if you're like, oh, I powdered too much. Yeah, I mean, it's so easy. Like, I literally just went like this, guys, too. Like, pop, <laughs> and then went like this. See how pretty that is over powder, too? So, just to kind of give you an idea, powdered no powder if you're not like looking for like a you know really all over intense glow you're like oh I, I may have put it too much on you can go over it with a little powder it's totally fine so I'm going to show you too how I use this on the lips so I take my finger that's it <laughs> so easy this shade is gorgeous y'all it's so beautiful I love love the shade so if you do use powder it also doesn't and you're using like a good bit of the miracle bomb it definitely tones it down and just really sets it really nicely right let me put on some mascara I'll be right back I just add a little bit of mascara, kept it fresh on the eyes, nothing's on the eyes. Very fresh, very beautiful. I did not powder this side yet. We're gonna see what you like. <laughs> you guys gotta let me know. Um, no, but I hope that the swatches were super helpful for you guys. I hope that you enjoyed this video. I really appreciate you guys being here. I invite you to subscribe, subscribe below. I'll link everything down in the description box for you guys in case you know, you missed a name or anything like that. I truly appreciate you guys. I'll leave my latest video right here and I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye y'all.